what's up you guys putting a trailer hitch on your lincoln corsair can take you and your family to some really fun places like camping and bike riding and even tow a u-haul trailer to just about anywhere in north america come on let's break this installation down these are the tools you'll need to complete this installation okay we need to prep the underbody for the hitch installation um, my, the first thing I'm going to do is lower the exhaust. I'll be using a strap to support the exhaust as it comes down. And I'll just go to this pipe here and uh, attach it to the cross member up here. Okay, now we're gonna lower the exhaust by lowering the two exhaust brackets, one here on the driver's side and then one over here on the passenger side. Okay, I'll be using a 10 millimeter socket to lower the bolt. On the passenger side exhaust bracket, there's a wire harness attached to the bracket with a nut. We're going to remove the nut using an 11 millimeter socket. then that'll allow us to remove the exhaust bracket with the 10 millimeter socket. Next, we're gonna remove four body clips securing underbody felt to the bottom of the frame on the driver's side and the passenger side, here and here. Okay, I'll be using a flathead screwdriver and a trim panel tool to help me lower these body clips. Now that we've prepped the underbody for the hitch install, let's go ahead and point out our hitch attachment points on the frame here. One, two, three on the driver's side. One, two, three on the passenger side. Our next step is to fish wire our provided half inch carriage bolt and plate into the frame through the access holes. And as you can see um, on the, the access hole that's located on the side of the frame here, the carriage plate fits through just fine but the half inch carriage bolt uh, just barely does not. So we have two options here. We can modify the access hole, opening up a little bit to accept the carriage bolt, or we can grind down uh, the carriage bolt a little bit so that it'll fit through. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and grind down the carriage bolt so I don't have to cut the customer's vehicle. Now we're gonna go ahead and fish wire the carriage bolt and carriage plate into the frame using the access hole. Then we'll go ahead and take our carriage plate, carriage bolt, and screw it onto the coiled end of the fish wire. And then just pull, and it'll come right through just like that. Now we'll repeat these steps on the passenger side. Now we're gonna go ahead and flip the underbody felt back under the frame here. Uh, we will not be installing the underbody clips to secure it because the uh, felt will be sandwiched between the hitch and the frame. Okay, we're ready to put the hitch into place. I'll be using the U-Haul exclusive hitch jack. If you don't have one of these, you'll need to get an extra set of hands. The hitch can be pretty heavy. Now that I have the hitch, just below the frame, I'm gonna go ahead and take my fish wire and then route it through the hitch holes as it goes up. Okay, now that we have our hitch in place, we're gonna go ahead and take the provided flange nuts and Screw them on the bolts here. We'll go ahead and repeat the same on the passenger side. Okay, we've got the hitch in place and the hardware secured. We're gonna go ahead and torque the bolts down to the manufactured specs using a three quarter inch socket and a five inch extension.
Okay, our next step is to raise the exhaust back up. Okay, so we ran into a slight problem here. Our exhaust bracket is hitting the flange on the nut for the hitch. Um, so what we're gonna do is lower the exhaust again, grind down a little bit of that flange on the nut and then raise the exhaust back into position. Now we'll repeat these steps on the passenger side. Okay, now that we have the vehicle on level ground, let's get you some important measurements. This is a two inch receiver from the ground to the top of the inside of the receiver tube is 13 and a half inches. From the pinhole to the rear edge of the bumper is five and a half inches. That's gonna help you determine the length, rise, and drop for any hitch accessories such as a bike rack or cargo carrier. Thank you for watching our video. Enjoy your hitch, enjoy the outdoors. Have fun and be safe. If you have any questions about this video or would like to have your hitch installed by a U-Haul Hitch Professional, please visit us at uhaulhitches.com.